Today's collectible spot, we are having a look at the Diamond Select Toys, Batman the Classic TV Series, Batman and Robin, Bus Bank. Coming to us from the king, it seems, of bus collectible bus banks, Diamond Select Toys. Uh, Diamond Select has produced tons of different collectible banks for ways that you guys can hold and store your change. Uh, now they have released both Batman and Robin in bus banks. And basically bus banks, it just means like the bus themselves. Uh, it's just a half body. And then you've got your bus slot on the backs there. Uh, Batman and Robin are really cool. And uh, A, I'm loving the fact, as I put my finger up here, A, I'm loving the fact that uh, Batman, the classic TV series, the licensing has now been made available, so that's why we're getting like Blu-rays and figures and stuff like that. But B, I'm also happy to see that Diamond Select Toys have got on board at producing things like busts and collectible pieces and banks. Uh, these are really neat looking banks. Above and beyond them holding your change, in some cases the banks are also posable. Not by a lot, but in the case of Batman, his arm does rotate, and uh, his arm also rotates here. Kind of like the Wolfman that uh, Spot also had a look at uh, from Diamond Select Toys. Their arms do rotate slightly, depending on the pieces that you get. Robin only has really a swivel in the hand, uh, kind of in the bicep area. But still, you can kind of pose them depending on how you want to display them. This also, too, just because you're going to be displaying them and you can pose them a little bit, the end result, too, is a really neat place to store your change. Batman has a slot in the top by his cape, as we already mentioned. Robin also has a, a slot in the uh, cape section where you can also put your change. If you ever need to access Batman or Robin, the underside here, you're just going to rotate, and then you'll be able to open that up and get your change inside. Uh, it's a good size, too. I mean... Factoring in, the arms are not part of the bank. Excluding the arms, you're still getting a good amount of space in there to store change. This would be a great place to store up money. You want to save your money if you want to be buying that, that action figure or something that you guys want to get, or a comic book. You can kind of put your change in Batman and then take them out, fittingly enough, take the change out of the Cape Crusaders and go buy your, uh, your superhero collectibles. Paint on them is quite nice too. Uh, Diamond Select, when they also had produced uh, some Batman and Robin busts, and I really like those because th there's a sheen. I really like the coloring that they use for the cape and cowl on Batman. It's kind of almost like a metallic blue. It doesn't really look metallic, granted, but there's like a little bit of uh, metallic flex in it that gives it that really neat sheen to it. That same color also carries over to his gloves which has the Batman little uh, Batman spikes on the, on the gloves there. And, of course, he's got his very trusty, reliable utility belt, painted very nicely in yellow and the gold on the front bu uh, belt buckle area there. Uh, I like the expression of Batman's face, too. He's just there. He's just... It seems like Batman's got a section in his hand where he really should have had, like, a, a Batarang or something like that. But uh, yeah, that's still really a nice-looking piece. And then you have Robin. Also has that kind of metallic, uh, metallic yellow in the cape section, and he's decked out in red, yeah, uh, the green, and then a little bit of yellow uh, in the utility belt and in the uh, the R logo for Robin. Uh, he, and also too, Robin is as he should be smaller than Batman. You wouldn't want him obviously the same height as Batman. And to access the change the same way, you want to rotate it until see right there, it's. You can see the plastic underneath. Keep rotating it until you see an open slot. And as soon as you do that, you can pull this right out. Spots picked up a couple of different bus banks from the folks over at uh, Diamond Select Toys. They've created anything, everything really from Universal Studios monsters that we've looked at in the past with the Bride of uh, Frankenstein, the Wolfman. They produced alien banks from, from the 1979 aliens, Batman and Robin. It's really neat. Uh, bus are the one of the things, bus banks are certainly one of those things where you want to be storing change. You can either store it in just a regular piggy bank or you can do it really cool. Uh, again, the folks over at Diamond Select Toys are producing some awesome banks. 
most of which you can usually find in your local comic book stores. If for some reason you can't find them, you can always do what I do and go to my local comic book store and they can order them in for you. They A lot of times the, the dealers there have like previews magazines and they can order from those catalogs. So if you don't see them in your local comic book stores, always ask the guy. Get to know your local comic book guy. Support the local comic book stores, which I'm always advocating. And uh, get to know them and they can order stuff in for you. Today's collectible spot, Spot was having a look at a couple of really cool banks. Today we're having a look at Diamond Select Toys, Batman the Classic TV Series, Batman, and Robin the Bus Bank. Thanks for watching as you always do, guys. Stay tuned. Spot's going to have more videos also heading your way. See you guys next time.